Hello, I'm Craig Prangley. I'm the project director for Taylor Woodrow Bam Nuttall. And here we are at the Victoria Station Upgrade. This project is special purely down to its location in central London, the shallowness of the tunnels, the fact that we're mining in areas that have been historically unsuccessful in the past. The biggest challenge was undoubtedly the ground treatment. Um, it was all done from the surface. Uh, you've been above ground here, you can see the traffic, you can see the pedestrians. We managed to manage those things, all the expectations of the stakeholders and the people around us whilst installing over 1,200 jet grout columns uh, in the ground and uh, allowing us to tunnel through uh, a completely different um, substrate that we turned into concrete. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a very big project with lots of really key challenges, um, but you know, the reward that you get from, from closing those out, so like on the DMT underpass where I was running the section, you know, the, the ability to kind of challenge some key principles, uh, find solutions and, and then see the rewards with the final product, uh, an excellent thing to be able to see. I think the fact that um, we reduced the disruption to the operational railway has got to be a massive win from that point of view for everybody. You know, we could have closed the railway every other weekend for the whole of 2014 and we didn't. One of the big challenges with the District Circle Line underpass is its proximity to the existing railway. So you see it just behind me in the actual railway slab, the actual track is just above, just above that plain piece of concrete there. So the roof of this, of this underpass is only around 600 millimetres from the underside of the sleepers. So you know, we're working really tight tolerances. Uh, within that, there are some telescoping uh, steel members that allow us to effectively underpin the District and Circle Line track, uh, slab uh, and road above. Uh, without having to re-enter the track environment. So our ability to come up with these new ideas, you know, this relatively simple telescoping method uh, has really managed to change the way we've built this on the pass and, and allow us to deliver this project. It's difficult in a way because nobody ever sees the tunnel. You know, something like somebody else comes along and makes it look pretty. But in reality, you know, we've built something here that is a huge benefit to people and you can't not feel proud about what you've achieved.